Hi, my name's Renee, and I'm currently 22 years in remission from sarcoma. I was only 19 years old when two doctors dismissed the symptoms that I felt in my leg. And while I knew something was different, uh, it didn't matter that they didn't feel the lump because I knew I did. And I don't know how, but as a teenager, I insisted to the third doctor to please do a scan. From that and many other tests that followed, I received a diagnosis of synovial cell sarcoma. 22 years ago, sarcoma was rare and treatment at that time for sarcoma or in the type that I had was still debatable. Some were treating with the typical trio, but some were saying that chemo wouldn't even work. So at only 19 years old, I had to make a decision that a teenager should not have to make. I should have been doing research for a paper I had due in my college psychology class, not research on a cancer that I couldn't find information on. I should have been staying up late with friends, not in bed early because I had to get up at 5 a.m. for early radiation treatment. And I was supposed to be planning my summer vacation or preparing to hang out at the beach with friends. But instead, I was recovering from surgery that left me fighting to regain the strength that I needed to walk and hiding the shame that I felt from the large scar that was traced on the back of my leg. Sarcoma is what they call the forgotten cancer because now even 22 years later, there's still not enough research to help those who get diagnosed. And even though it accounts for up to 15% of childhood cancers, it's still considered rare. It's difficult to detect and it often goes misdiagnosed. I've met, fought for, and have lost friends and family from sarcoma. And I hope we continue to work towards a cure for them and for the 10 to 15,000 who unfortunately will be diagnosed each year, 22 years later. I hope that gives you hope. I'm alive, I walk, I run, I have a beautiful family. But no matter the amount of time that passes, those moments I experienced and the fear that sarcoma has left me will never go away. So keep fighting and help us to find a cure.